A widow kneeled next to her husband's grave as sirens wailed following rockets launched from Lebanon into northern Israel Monday. The mourners, attending the funeral of Alexei Popov who was killed by rockets, were seen taking cover behind gravestones as loud explosions and interceptions followed. Popov was killed Saturday in Acre, northern Israel, after a rocket attack fired from Lebanon. Israeli forces invaded southern Lebanon at the beginning of the month and have been operating in a narrow strip along the border. Israeli airstrikes have pounded large areas of the country, targeting what Israel says are Hezbollah sites. The militant group has fired thousands of rockets, missiles and drones into Israel since October 8, 2023, the day after its ally Hamas launched a surprise attack into Israel, triggering the war in Gaza. Wow, why is it poor? Why is it a fall poor? Better than me. נשבע לך באלוהים. תקשיב, הרקטה נפלה פה, בבית העלמין. ממש, ראית את היירוט שנפל פה? אחי, היירוט נפל פה, בבית העלמין. The Israeli military said Sunday it had struck more than 100 military targets in the last day belonging to Hezbollah in southern Lebanon. The army released footage said to show airstrikes on the Hezbollah targets in the area of al Mira. Israel has meanwhile ramped up strikes on the southern neighborhood of Beirut known as the Dahia, a crowded residential area. Hezbollah has a strong presence there but it is also home to large numbers of civilians and people unaffiliated with the Lebanese militant group. A year of escalating tensions boiled over into all-out war last month. Israel sent ground troops into Lebanon at the start of October. Israel's war against Hezbollah, the Iran-backed militant group, stretches far inside Lebanon, and its airstrikes in recent weeks have killed more than 1,700 people, about a quarter of whom were women and children, according to local health authorities. Some of the more than 50 Israelis killed by Hezbollah over the past year were hit by anti-tank missiles. The Israeli military said Sunday that more than 170 rockets were launched from Lebanon at northern Israel.
Israeli firefighters worked to extinguish a blaze in northern Israel Sunday after rockets were launched from Lebanon. Israeli police officers were seen next to the site of a fire directing traffic, after an attack in the area near the town of Rosh Pina in northern Israel. The Israeli army updated Sunday that, approximately 160 projectiles that were fired by Hezbollah crossed into Israel. Hezbollah began firing rockets into Israel a day after Hamas' October 7 attack. After nearly a year of tit-for-tat fighting with Hezbollah, Israel launched its ground invasion into southern Lebanon on October 1, 2024, and has since sent thousands of troops into the rugged terrain. Israel's war against Hezbollah, the Iran-backed militant group, stretches far inside Lebanon, and its airstrikes in recent weeks have killed more than 1,700 people, about a quarter of them women and children, according to local health authorities. Some of the more than 50 Israelis killed by Hezbollah over the past year were hit by anti-tank missiles.